Hello everyone, welcome back to Ocean Block. Uh, I literally just loaded back in, so I wanted to see, do I have my, oh, I've got my cobble. I still do this just in case. Just because, block update, right? And then we can see all of this stuff again. Uh, how we do it on these things? So we actually went down on the iron, I think. Which makes sense because we made the uh, super awesome disc uh, last episode, right? So this thing. Dun, 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 dun. Should probably move all of these discs into this one. Can I do that? Just do this and then these two are full as well. I'm just going to set these like that and pop this one back in for now. Uh, is this going up as well? It is not. That's a good, that's good news. That means that there's nothing going into our system that's not in a drawer. Which I like. Which doesn't make sense. Wait, because this, this is... Ah, I know why that's happening. If we go here, yeah, these are full up. <laughs> I need to do these ones as well at some point. Ah, well. Um, I'll let those drain. It's got max upgrades. Should pull stuff out. That's going to take a while though. Ooh, can I... Yeah, you can't climb in a bowl this, unfortunately. Uh, but yeah, this episode, I kind of wanted to get into making singularities or at least a couple of them setting up the autumn automation for them at least so the first thing we should do is quantum let's set up the recipe for this thing here so main recipe is like that then we need to make this quintessence easily make that as well so what's the next stuff make this Black iron slate, but we need black iron, which is again easy enough to make. And then, yeah, I'll set up all the recipes for this and we will be back once that is done. And there we go. So that's all of the recipes for the quantum thingy, this thing. So we should be able to, oh, there it is, just to type Q in and we've got one. So we're going to need a few of these, I, I believe. In fact, that might be a quest. Is a quest. It's the first one in Endgame. Oh, yeah, these are the ones we're going to want to make. I don't know what the creative ME storage does because you kind of need. Why is create a bin a thing? That's T infinite. Why does this store items? I'm very confused by that. <laughs> anyway, so um. As I said, the first thing that we'll be going for, we need to make the ultimate singularity, then the creative essence to make the creative capacitor, which then we can create the creative energy cube. <sighs> yeah. That was a lot of words right there. <laughs> Once we've got this creative energy cube, we can kind of set up a butt ton of these power pots. And the first thing we will do with the power pots is set up all the recipes needed for power pots in power pots if you know what i mean so i'm thinking this area here we can just have like a big line of power pots going along this way same on the other side right all of those because there is a cable right under here if i remember correctly yeah so all of those will be connected with those interfaces these things but yeah, let's let's actually just get going on a few of these automated things. So I think the first one we should do. I kind of don't want to pull out. I, I was thinking about the clay, clay one, by the way. So I don't really want to pull out the clay that we've got over here. I know we've got like a ton of it. That is going up. Should have stopped. It has stopped. Nice. But what I'm thinking is, I basically set one of these up but in here so maybe down here right at the back here so I set one of these up here 
Then I'll have the quantum compressor. Ooh, it does take power. 10 million FE, blimey. So we can put a flux point underneath and then we can feed everything that comes out of those into here. Uh, and then we could extend this over and then down and just import the... Yeah, we can import the input into this. In fact, I think we need one of these catalysts as well. So how many of the um, singularities are there? One, two, three. All right, let me count these and I'll be back. So it looks like there's 30 of them overall. Let's grab this. Another ring of magnetism, lovely. Um, and it kind of does this in a weird order a singularity singularity I don't think I've seen this before oh oh that's gonna be yeah that's a pain <laughs> I had a comment from I think it was Paul Paul mentioned that these ones are a, a massive pain to make because you need to make how many do you need for this yeah 1500 which means you need 1500 of these 64k ME storage disks which means you need 1500 of these calculation processors uh, actually you need 3000 no wait you need a good amount of these calculation processors that goes all the way down and then you need like a butt ton of these logic processors Whoa. yeah that's going to be uh interesting this basic crate one i think will be relatively easy to make we've got iron nuggets because of um the compacting drawer we're using uh, it's just small crates although these these do require stripped oak logs yeah okay so we need to set some automation up for stripped oak logs we might need to do a better tree farm than than our very basic crappy tree farm uh, this is our tree farm right now botany pots obviously botany pots <laughs> yeah okay well we'll do that in another episode I think today what I want to do is the clay one and I did kind of have my eye on like doing a, a difficult one this one's gonna be a right pain you can make this using these items here, but I don't really want to spend 1,500 diamonds. Also, I'm not sure we're getting prismarine shards. How do we get this? Yeah, that's going to be a pain. I mean, we can set the seed up for that. We might have to actually set the seed up for that. What is it to make one of these? Oh, some of this essence. But that should be fine because there's loads of loads of that stuff in. Uh, if I go to this and then we can have a look. Where are those interesting looking buildings? Not these ones. These ones? Yes, these ones here. I think there's a load of prismarine like block things down there. So we can go grab those. Uh, this is more of a planning episode, I should say. Logic ones, so we can do these. And I think we've already got the auto craft for this. So let's have a look. Logic. Yeah, we've already got the auto craft. Can we do 1500 of these? No, we're missing chorus fruit. It requires a lot of pop popped chorus, chorus fruit right there. That'll take a while to process as well. Um. Oh, I have an idea. Uh, upgrades. Make six of these. So, the way we're doing chorus fruits is we've got it set up over here. But if I do this. 
almost fully upgraded. I normally put a void upgrade in here, but you don't need a void upgrade for this. But yeah, this will just keep going. Uh, maybe we make, maybe put this in a power pot. You can get some that way. Uh, I remember this one. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't remove this one. Huh. Funny. Uh, there we go. Back up here. Yeah, but what that will do is, because in here we've got like the patterns for stuff, it will go off and it will try and make all of the, oh, all of the, like stuff for that should be easy enough to make once we've got enough core fruit but we can leave that for now and leave that running upstairs come back to that later let's let's set up the clay one so for the clay one we need an exporter and i think that's it is that all we need is an exporter yeah, I think so. Let's get a 2x2 two two draw. Why are you not showing all the draws? Oh, of course, because this is still being... Yeah, this is still coming into our system. I think I've probably filled up a bunch of those 1Ks, right? Yeah. Oh, I should probably set the priority on these to be, like, minus... Minus one, minus one, and that way, if everything else is, yeah, there we go. If everything else is full, then it will start going into these, and I will between episodes, I'll, I'll make sure these actually <laughs> are drained into our system. As again, again, I, I only put these down here because it matches what's in Subnautica, and. That doesn't really make sense considering I haven't done anything else down here yet. Like, there's supposed to be an area where I can get my Seamoth in here. But I haven't done anything with that in a while. I really need to do some base building. Maybe we do that next episode. Uh, if you don't enjoy watching people build stuff, just leave me a comment and I'll do it between episodes instead. I think that would be a nice compromise. Uh, anyway, we were looking at doing an exporter, which we'll put in. I wanted to make it was a two by two, which is one of these. Should have, um, yeah, there we go, two by two. Uh, we need our key for this. Oh God, it's in us. It's in one of these. I mean, for now, I can just take these out, put them back in here. It's a priority of one. And we should have our key in here now. <laughs> yeah, there we go. So let's get this and this. Then we need some jar stuff. Jar mod. One of these. One of these. I could make one of those anchor things as well. One of these, which is, um, if you look at this, it's plus four times efficiency for no temperature whatsoever. If I look at no temperature, glowstone is 1.5, just stone is one times efficiency. What was uh, crying obsidian? Two. So, yeah, we can make one of these because we have a bunch of crying obsidian. So I can go under here, and then all we need now is a tank. Just need one of those. So what we could have is this here. Whack that on there, and that it should export. We don't want this to be very, very, very quick, right? We need to set a limit on this. Uh, maybe I'll move this over as well. Yeah. Get this right in the corner. Let's pop that back down. So, this goes here.
Where do we want to put the jar? We can put the jar right here. Yeah, because we get this to export into here. Um, yeah, that makes sense. Right, let's put this like that. Just like that, and then smash this one out. Do this and this. I should put a detector on this as well. So I only want one of these uh, things in the system at once. Why? Detector. And I'm hoping you can do the JEI trick for this. As in, I'll pop that down and then I can drag stuff. Yeah, I can. Lovely. So, singularity. Clay singularity. So, I only want one. Emit. Awesome. And then this can be only work without a redstone signal. So, that means when we get one clay singularity, it will stop exporting. And the last thing that should need doing and a little bit tidy up right there is we put our tank like this and now oh yeah we also need to power this so let's uh, why why is it not letting me do the yeah I swear that was a longer range anyway so now I need a flux point flux point luckily I made a bunch of them last episode I should just have a stack of those in there at all times. Disable limit. Okay, how much is that? Oh, well, this is filled up already. So now we can just get this to make. Oh, I didn't set the. I didn't set that up. Okay. So let's grab. Gravel. And sand. And we want to lock these just in case. So now, why are you do you not like going into this? Ah! Uh. Oh crap! I didn't make the, uh, the the thing that that like converts them all. Uh, that might be too quick as well. I don't know if I've set up the recipe for that either. Let me set the recipe up, which means we need this thing. And what I've been doing is, I think I put them in this one up here, yeah. So, something like that. And then, core, no, what's that thing called? Catalyst. And there it is. Awesome. And you can see it on top, it's creating a clay. Clay one, lovely. You can stick that in there as well. I want to see if this can, this thing can keep up. Oh, it most definitely can. Right, let's stop that for now. Because we also want an importer. Arg. Also, whilst we're here, wireless. I've got one of these. And is it a card or? To increase the wireless strength. Let's do upgrade. Range upgrade, that's it. I've not taught that to my system, fair enough. Upgrade, and we'll make four of those.
Beautiful. And now what we can do is just slap one of these down here. Why do you always do that? What? Why are you not lit up? You should be lit up. Did I do something wrong? Did I break anything? Oh, my plan was to uh, be able to get into the system again, and then I don't have to... Okay, that's very strange. Why are you not connected? Definitely going up here. You're definitely connected here. You only have one on each network. I've got this one. Very weird. Um, okay, I'm gonna leave that for now. I think that might be bugged out or something. Is it because I put it in like a weird place first? Let's try it on this side. Just don't wanna do that one, do you? These are all getting filled up, so they are fine. What is going on with this? Why can I not put another transmitter on here? Can I put another one up here? What the heck? Okay, never mind. That was a... God, yeah, that was a, a weird thing that was happening. Anyway, this is still going up because I've told it to. Uh, we needed an importer. Should just be able to plop it on top because... I'm hoping it doesn't pull out any clay. See what's happening with this. Limit input. So this should be now. Why? Why does it not like limited input? It's very weird. This is like a bunch in there now. This is probably stopped. Yeah, this has. Should set up a trash can on this then. Just trash everything else. It doesn't like doing it if you've got that set on unlimited. In fact, that's fine. We can just keep this going. There you go. That will make probably two in the time it takes to register to not put anything in here. Actually, that's got a big backlog. So let's make a couple of these clay singularities. But now, if I go over here, singularity. First singularity on the account. There it is. Right up here. That gave us an infinity trident. That's actually a pretty good thing to get. It's going to just drain our system. That's not amazing. <laughs> it just drained like a billion RF. Yep. It just drained out all of the power from all of these. And uh, over here. Yeah, it started on these as well. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, God. Right. Okay. We chuck that back in our system, we don't need that. Oh, and I took the singularity out, so it probably just kept putting stuff in over here. Because this should no longer go up. How many singularities did we make from that? Two. Probably three. It's 
probably making another one right now. Um, he's <laughs> making quite a lot. That'll probably make us, I don't know, 15 singularities. Not sure. Why is this still going up though? Because we have got, oh, emit when above. Got yeah, because it made marble. So this should stop now. I'm gonna take that out. We'll let that do its thing, and in fact, let's put this back in our curio slot because we know it's knackered. Why is that bouncing back up and down? Not really using you right now. Oh yeah, also I forgot that I can use my equals button to uh, teleport if I wanted to, and I can. I can use my blink function to, to move around as well, if I wanted to. Uh, right, so there's one singularity. Let's have a look for another relatively easy one, and uh, try and get the automation set up for that. So the Terra Steel Nugget one is quite easy for us to make. Silicon, we can make that easy enough as well. I'm going to try and do all of these down here. So we need a quantum. Let's make two of these and set two of them up. We also need a catalyst. What was this um, leak catalyst? Oh, it's just to make these tables. Right. We will need to make a table at some point. So that's how you make the crystalline ingots. Nope, I didn't mean to have a look at that. I meant to... Ah, oh, it doesn't matter, we got these now. Anyway, um, let's go for our quantum compressors. There we go. So for these ones, them like that. Stick that in, stick that in. We need exporters and importers for this. So I can put an exporter here going in this side, export here going in this side. Oh, exporter. I need two of these please. Crafting cards as well. Importer. Two of those as well, please. Lovely. Right, now for this one, that is exporter, which can go right here. Right here. Import goes on top. Couple of cables. That is connected now because it's connected via this thing. Even though this doesn't look like it's connected, it is. All good. So, uh, we also need power, so let's get some flux points. Now all we need to do is set the exporters up. So that one's doing that, that one's doing that. What were the two that we were looking at? So... Uh, there was... Terra Steel Nuggets, we set the recipe up for that. Cake Singularity. Oh. Slice of cake. Ooh. Cutting board, we need to figure out how to automate that. We might be able to use our favorite player simulator thing. Blazing capacitors. That's already set up. 
we could tell it to do this. Only thing about that is it's going to take up a lot of the time in our thing that we've already set up for that. So if I run back over, uh, or I could just press equals and then we're over here. In, I think it's our first one, this bit here. So it's going to take a lot of time like using these blaze rods to turn them into blazing crystals and so on and so on. But we need this for the blue ice. I might actually set this up again purely for dry ice. Uh, but I'll do that between episodes and we'll figure something else out. What was the other one? So I know we had Terra Steel Nuggets. Pig Iron. Mm. Silicon. Which is this one here, silicon. Let's do let's let's bookmark these so we know them. Terra steel nuggets. So first one is silicon. We didn't actually need property card for this one, but that one will just plonk a load of silicon in there. It's not going to be very quick. Doesn't need to be. Uh, maybe we put the exporter on top. Yeah, I'm going to do that. And then have the importers on the side because there's a reason. And that is... Then we can set up the uh, detectors. Come on. There we go. Set the detectors up quite nicely doing it this way. Set importers on the side. Exporter. Uh, I'm going to leave the crafting card out of that one because we don't need it. And pop that back in. So that will go off and it will start creating the silicon stuff. Now, once I go back over here, I can get some detectors. the thing so you can go off and craft that. Thank you. Can go one up here, one up here. So emit a signal when above and silicon singularity. Put that one in there. Is that one above or You not do one above or equal to. Let's just make two anyway, because I know we've got enough silicon for that. And then this exporter will only export when it doesn't have a redstone signal. So this will turn on when there's multiple singularities in there. And it's signal when above zero, so one. When it's above zero, it could be one. So once we've got one of these singularities, it will go off and do it. That one has stopped. So we've got a load of clay singularities, lovely. So that's slowly going up. And now this one does need a... Don't make... Okay, good. I thought it put in some crafting cards there, but... Uh, we need this to export terra steel nuggets. So we do... Do this, drag this over. And that is put one in there already because we had one in our system from somewhere not exactly sure where that came from but uh, if we go back up here we can teach uh, Terra Steel that's a good one to teach first using this this stuff we've got a ton of this I bet now uh, let's pop that in here for now and we can also teach nuggets. Pop that up there as well. And now, if we fly over here, this should be going up. So it's creating the nuggets for us. Creating the terra steel first, which we have got quite a lot of. 
20k. Okay, we might swap this over now. Seeds. What seeds do we have that we could do with a lot more of? Netherite. That's always a good one to have a lot more of. Let's do that. We'll figure out something else for between episodes. That one grows really quickly. What the heck? We should probably also compact this down. See how many we get between episodes and now. So that's 142. Remember that number. We've <laughs> just got another 8. So, right. Anyway, uh, what's the next one that we should do? Let's, let's have a look at this. Actually, let's have a look see if our. So we've got 10 out of that. That's amazing. <laughs> Uh, brilliant. Oh, that was what we wanted to put in there, actually. Grab one of these flowers. Uh oh. <laughs> no, don't don't go back up. Oh, this is such a weird point of view. Uh, actually, we did... Oh, we're back. Nice. We did want to put this in here. Can it go in this? What, what does this take? Endstone. Uh, I mean, we can put endstone in this, right? is kind of slow. Did not expect it to be that slow. All right, I'll be back when this finishes and we can see how many we get. So that did just finish, but I think it imported too quickly. So I'm going to take the stack upgrade out first. And again, I'll wait for this to finish and then we can see how many we get from this. And it's about to finish. Oh, three stacks. It's pretty good. Cool, so we'll be at the, the amount of chorus fruit that we need almost soon, actually, looking at it. Uh, what do we need for... So one more craft of that, and we should have enough to make 1,500 logic detector directors. Directors? Yeah. Yeah, directors, that's it. So I am gonna, that's just finished actually, so we should have enough now. 1500, start. Yeah, so that's gonna take a while because it has to go in here first, brush up all the memorial logs, and those into these. Then it will crush up all of these. Well, this is a bit slow, isn't it? Is that because I've got... Do I not have a uh, speed upgrade on this? No, okay. So let's make a stack upgrade first. Okay, so this is stopping this from working right now, making these stack upgrades because it's trying to cook all this chorus fruit into popped chorus. Uh, and it shares that with the one that's making the improved processor. Okay, all right, let's give this a minute to finish. So this is just about to finish, just finished. Should, yeah, there we go, stack upgrades have been obtained. And 
and speed. I mean, we don't probably don't need speed. Oh, we've got stack. I also don't think that this one needs a stack upgrade particularly, but is it? Yeah, gets that much and then instantly goes out. It only makes one item, whereas I know this one here makes like multiple items, right? That should be fine now. Squeezing all of that. I don't think we need this in here now. Well, for right now at least. We might need to, when we get unlimited power, we'll probably put that back in. And I do know that we need quite a bit of these singularities to actually do stuff, right? I think to make the creative, we need four of them and we need how many for, I uh, didn't mean to pin that, sorry. Yeah, so we need four, eight, 12, 16, 20 to make the passer. Plus we need another two in here, so that's 22. Plus we need four from this, so that's 26. Oh, so we need 26 of each singularity to get to the creative energy cube stage. And then from there we should be golden because we could just set up a bunch of these power pots and not have to worry about our power draining. Should only need one, might need multiple, I'm not sure of the creative cubes. Uh, yeah, oh well, well, we'll find out when we get there, I suppose. So that should be making us the logic. So I can set up another quantum thingy. I'll set that up downstairs and then we'll be back. I also finally set up a pattern for the detector because yeah, that was uh, getting a bit annoying. So now we've got a detector. Right, back in a sec. All right, and there we go. We've got the logic directors going into another quantum. So we've got three of them set up now. Four of them set up, sorry. I forgot about the clay one. How could I forget about the clay one? We've got tons of them now. So that's four out of 30. So we're making our, making our way there. Uh, I might start ticking them off somehow. We don't need these anymore. We actually don't need these two here either, so I might just pick these up. We need that one. Hello cow. Making us lots of poop. Pooping your heart out. <laughs> cool, okay, I think um, four singularities, pretty good. We got the easy ones, I think. Uh, some of these are going to be the sea, sea pickle one we can kind of set up now because we can put those in a power pot again put it in our big power pot a bucket of water so let's set that up before I won't set up the quantum thingy but we can set it up before we end the episode I think used all my buckets what we can do is this I did swap this back out for the netherite thing because I thought we could we could do with the netherite one. Chuck that in. See pickle, you can go in as well. I want to see how many this this makes. Should be a good whack of them, right? Oh, just a stack. Still good, still good. Don't don't get me wrong, still good. But yeah, that will create us loads. We need 1,500 of those as well for one of the singularities. Nice one. Right. I'm going to have to call it there, I think. Thank you for joining me. Thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.